Hi YouTube! So today I have a big haul for you guys. Uh, this is actually from a few stores. And I'm going to start off with Forever 21. So I bought these shorts. And it looks like a ruffled skirt, but they're actually shorts at the bottom. So they are shorts. I can't show you guys. You can't really tell, but they are shorts. And they were... $17.80. I bought this shirt, which was $24.80. And it looks like this. Let me stand up. Looks like this. And it's just a blue and white striped shirt, if you can see. And it has these, um, like, military-inspired buttons going on here. And you can tie it in the middle. You either tie it forward or in the back. There are three-fourth sleeves, or you can wear them long if you unbutton it. So, and what I liked about this, um, can't tell because it's all wrinkled and stuff, but it's like a bubbly um, bottom to the shirt. So when you put it on, it's like very bubbly. So it actually makes me look kind of pregnant, but I think it's cute. So, I got that. Then, um... I also bought this cardigan sweater and it's just like a neutral color uh, and just some plain buttons it has pockets in the front and it is long sleeve it looks like this and this cardigan or sweater whatever one you want to call it was $12 I got this um, it's like a keychain kind of thing. Um, you put it on your pants, and then these hook onto where you usually put your belt through. And it's just a whole bunch of chains. Uh, some have rhinestones. So, yeah, and I can't really show you guys, but yeah, you just put these on your pants, and it hangs. So, yeah. Next. Uh, this past weekend I went to LA and I didn't really do any shopping really. The only thing I bought were these earrings from BB. It came in this box. The pink. <clears throat> and I've eyed these earrings before, but they actually had a sale the day I went in, which was 30% off of everything. So, I bought these squared gold earrings look like this and they're originally $19 and with the discount I got them for like about $14.50. Next um, I stopped at Victoria's Secret and um, I've been wanting this hyper gloss eye shimmer and all it is it's a very glittery shimmery um, I guess you could put it as a highlight or the corner of your um, eye and it looks like this. Comes in a, a silver tube. So if you can kind of see the glitter. It looks a lot better in person. Um, my camera and lighting isn't really catching it. But yeah, so I got that. And the hyper gloss was... Let's see. Twelve dollars? Yeah, twelve dollars. Um, so that was twelve dollars. And then I've heard almost everybody on YouTube rant about Victoria's Secret lip glosses. I don't know if you've seen these before, and they talk about how great they are and how wonderful they are. So I've never really been interested in them. They never really caught my attention. I'm not big on lip gloss. But um, I decided to try them out. I had a gift card that um, gave me $10 off of any purchase. So I got two. And they're, I believe, two for 12 Let me check. Yeah, two for 12 So they came out to $6 each. And they're normally, I believe, $7. So I saved a dollar on each one. So I got this purple one which is called guava girl and this one smells so good it smells fruity i love it 
this convinced me to buy these and try them out. So this smelled so good. And then the other one I got was Slice of Heaven. And the reason I got it was just basically because of the color. It's like a neutral glittery color. So I got those two. And that was it for Victoria's Secret. And then I went to bed, uh, Bath and Body for candles. I love their... Um, I love their uh, their scented candles. They are my favorite, absolute favorite. Now they are pretty expensive. Um, the big ones cost twenty dollars. The small ones cost ten. So usually, what I do is I wait for them to go on sale, like when they're two for twenty, or the little ones are four for um, twenty or whatnot. So they had that sale going on, and I went in and I decided to get different flavors than um, scents that I usually. Get. So I got Frosted Cranberry, and this was more in, um, due to Christmas, so switched it up, and the other one was Blossom Cherry or something like that, but I actually gave that to my dad. Then, um, with every, I had like a little coupon too that I got to get a, like I get a free gift up to $13. So I got my dad this um, stress relief body wash. And this is one of his favorite um, lines from Bath and Body Work. To keep warm, I bought these socks. And I've been wanting these, but I didn't want to pay $7.50. But they were on sale for $3. So I got these red and green ones because they reminded me of the Grinch. And then I got some just the same, but they're white. And then it was like pink, like turquoise, and like a uh, blue color. But those are in the dirty hamper because I already used them. So that's all I got at Bath and Body Works. So now I'm going to move on to my Target. At Target, I didn't get too much. Um, I went in to get some of my like, essentials. I got some cotton balls, which aren't very interesting. And I went in to get my... Um, my scrub that I usually use, which is St. Eve's Apricot Scrub Blemish and Blackhead Control. And that's because I was running out, so I bought some of this. Um, then, I bought the Nicki Minaj Pink Friday uh, CD. The inside. If you look at her CD, it is so Barbie inspired. Awesome. So, got this. And I believe the CD was $11.99, so not too bad. Then... I got these huggable hangers. Look like this. And these were $6.99. Way to save some space and hang um hang like four to five or multiple clothing pieces on one hanger instead of using multiple hangers. So I'm gonna try this out and see if it actually works. Also, it's thin, so it uses less space in your um closet. So I'm trying these out. If I like it, I'll probably buy some more to make more space in my closet. And lastly at Target, I bought a calendar. And not only did I love the price of this calendar, but of course it was pink. So this is the calendar and it's pink with like brown polka dots and all the pages are the same and it's huge. And this was only a dollar. So you cannot go wrong for a dollar calendar this big. Now the reason um, I got a huge calendar is because I like to write things down constantly, like things I need to do, appointments, and I do have an agenda, but I don't always look at my agenda. So what I usually do is I have a calendar up on my wall, which is easier for me to see, and with a calendar this big, I'm obviously... Or how can I not notice my appointments or things that I need to do? So, check this out at Target. I think this is an excellent deal. So, yeah, you guys. That's it for my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And comment, subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye, YouTube.